you're talking about genetic screening is looking for something that's associated with a problem and that is inherited. You can have something that's associated with a problem that came by random chance or from your diet or something like that, and that would not be inherited. So, uh, you, whereas when you're talking about genetic screening, you're asking about something that would be inherited through the family that has not been uh, fully understood yet. So, you can look for commonly known changes that are pro widespread in the population and ask if they're present in you, in you or in your parents. Okay. You can test for new changes. That's not yet common, but it will become so. Uh, have you heard anything about the $1,000 genome projects? So what that would mean is that everybody would have a list of all of their gene types. So genes come in types, there's lots and lots of them in populations of people, hundreds of different types of each, at each particular place in the genome. So you would have a map of what your type was in each of these places. And if there were a known problem, you could look for that in your personal genome. 